everyone, welcome to the online class. Today we know we are going to study about the listening express 2 and the hangout 5 in the second video. So everyone, as in our first session, we will study about the listening express 2. In yesterday video, in the listening express 2, we have the question, what do you enjoy doing on your summer vacation? Have you answered this question yet, everyone? Very good. Okay. So there are many activities that people can do during the summer vacation. What are they? We have the indoor activities, outdoor activities, right? For indoor activities such as playing puzzle that we can play outside of the house, such as play hide and seek, go fishing. So today we are going to continue about getting started B. Getting started B. Now listen. Write the letter next to the correct picture. So you will listen to the track and you will also write the word next to the correct picture as well. So there are five pictures as what you can see on page 54, right? Don't waste any time, listen to track 070 together. Unit 8. It's summer. Getting started B. Now listen. Write the letter next to the correct picture. A. You should put on sunscreen if you go outdoors in summer. B. Kate's dad is teaching her how to surf this summer. She'll be great someday. C. Jim doesn't have to get up for school. He'll sleep for as long as he wants. D. In the summer, the girls watch movies and go to bed late. E. Our teachers make us do lots of homework during summer vacation. Okay, everyone, it's time to take about the answer together. So as what you can see in the picture part B, yes, the first picture, as what you can see, there are many people, they are watching the movie, right? And for the second picture, as what you can see, there are two people, and I guess perhaps dad and daughter, and they are on the beach, maybe they go surfing, right? And for picture number three, as what you can see, other man is, uh, maybe she's working with her, her, her task, or maybe she's doing the classwork or homework, right? And how about picture number four, everyone? Yes, that boy is, uh, really good at sleeping, right? Because as what you can see, maybe he has a nice sleep. And how about the last picture, everyone? Yes, as what I can guess, uh, the last picture, I can see a girl, she is applying the sunscreen on her face, right? Okay, everyone, so now let's take about our answer together. We are going to start with number one. So number one is letter B, okay. Number two is letter B. Number three is letter E. Number four is letter C. And last one, letter A. Okay, so have you found the correct answer like me, everyone? Yes, very good. Okay, so today we are going to know more words in words to know. A. Listen, write each word, then match each with its meaning. So there are four words that you are going to that you are going to match with the meaning okay so the first word is the word can memory break return all right so listen to try 071 together words to know a listen write each word then match each with its meaning number one break number two camp Number three, memory. Number four, return. All right, everyone. So after you listen to track uh, 71, I know that you have got the answer, right? Okay, so we are going to check the answer together with number one. Yeah, it is a thing or even that is remember. Okay, something that you remember. Perhaps your past time, perhaps something that you did in the past or a long time ago, and that thing you still remember. So this is what we call 
memory. Okay? So memory in here we refer to a thing or even that is remembered. Okay? Just like you had a birthday party when you were at 10 years old. So that so that even is keeping in your mind, in your memory. Okay? This is what we call memory. Next, number two, it is about to come or go back from somewhere. To come or go back. This is what we call the return. Okay, return. For example, like after a holiday, I return home. Or after uh, the summer vacation, I will return to school. Okay, this is the meaning of the word return. It means to come or go back from somewhere. So now number three, a place where children go to take part in different activities. Okay, so this is what we call camp. Okay, so have you ever been to camping before everyone? So camping is uh, the uh, adventurous activities that uh, children, they like to go uh, to explore themselves in the cave or at sea, in the forest in the jungle, right? So this is what we call camp. It is about a place where children go to take part in the different activities. Okay, last one is number four. It is what the word break. Okay, break in here is not the verb. If you say I break the window, it means like you made the window crack. Okay, but uh, break in here is the noun. So it is about a period of time when students don't go to school. For example, like uh, this, this month, I will have a break. I will have a summer break. So it means like that time, you will not go to school, okay? Summer break here is like the vacation that you will not go to school. Okay, so everyone, uh, for four of these words, you probably might see it a lot in somewhere, right? As, as the word came, just like what you have heard so far, like camping, yeah. I go to camping or I came with my friend. Okay, next is memory. Memory is something that you remember. Okay, this is what we call memory. How about memory card? Yeah, in your phone, you have a memory card for some phone, right? So that means that object store the memory, store something important in there. Okay, next is the word break. Break is the noun. Okay, now is we refer to a period of time that we stop from work or from school. Okay, the next is we have a return. Return to come and to go back from somewhere. Okay, yes, everyone, so that's it for the first video that we are focusing on the uh, words to know A, which is about the word came, memory, break, and return. So in the next session, we will study about the hang up five. So prepare yourself for the next session. Thank you.